I shared so much on this topic and I might as well share another video in regards to the many videos that I've already shared in the past there's so much misinformation going online basically recommending that males open up become vulnerable and share their feelings and all of this bullshit and what happens when a male does that he attracts masculine women doesn't he not gee I wonder why that is could anyone tell me um, it wouldn't be because he's happy happen he so happens even to be acting like a woman well there you go then what happens like I said when a guy acts vulnerable opens up shares his feelings and all of this bullshit like the movies predict what happens when a guy does that one he's repelling any chance with a feminine woman because he's acting like a bitch himself Two, all he's going to attract throughout his entire existence of life are masculine women. Or better yet, women that just want to basically bounce on his schlong and then can his ass, you know, like they do with the rest of the guys out there. And is there any wonder why, like I said, we have the collapse that we have within the dating market? Because some of us men, no matter how hard we appear pressured, cannot and will not be enticed into selling our souls for counterfeit goods it is what it is common sense which unfortunately the world lacks thereof so to you guys out there quit buying into this bullshit man quit buying into this bullshit of looking for information from false prophets, false teachers, or as I'd like to call them, false representations of God himself. Because when a guy, like I said, acts vulnerable, when he opens up and shares his feelings, he is acting like a little bitch and this is why he repels women and attracts the wrong type of women because he's being deceived by the devil and when I refer to he I'm referring to all of the male species here and this is why I recommend guys remain single just to prove a point that you mean business and that you're not going to basically sell yourself short for no one's business you will however keep on pissing people off by speaking the truth the sound biblical truth it is what it is and those of you that share this bullshit information you have to stop leaning upon your own understanding you have to stop believing in what you've heard read and seen within this false indoctrination that currently runs the system that we live in as I'd like to call it might I add the blue pill system that is deliberately set and constructed to fail people of all ages and both sexes man and woman Like I said, you could laugh and joke people all you want. You can actually think this is some sort of, you know, comical show as you will. But those of you that are trapped within these marriages, these relationships, you're not going to be laughing and joking when reality hits hard. And you begin to have your eyes awakened to the truth. When you see your so-called woman bouncing on your male friend or because she lost attraction to you in the first place or because she got what she wanted from you you're not going to be laughing acting all high and almighty as well as smug then are you? nope why is that? because you've had a taste of your own you've had a dose of reality 
you've had a reality check that the dating mark is isn't actually in fact what you think it is. And this is why, like I said, some of us choose to remain single. Because we know just exactly what is going on within this world. When these dumbasses clearly know nothing. They know nothing. They, they, they don't even have a brain cell to rub amongst themselves together in order to figure it out. That is how stupid, as well as ridiculous, people are given today's day and age. They are so stupid, as a matter of fact, that they would rather believe false information, false lies, disguised as sugar-coated truths, than take the uncomfortable truth, the biblical truth, which not only challenges them intellectually, but it is guaranteed to hurt feelings and emotions. And this is how I know the vast majority of people are living within a blue-pilled society. Because they don't operate from logic. They operate on feeling and emotion. Because they're a bunch of pussies. They can't acknowledge the truth for what it really is. Me? I'm at peace with it. It is what it is. And you know you're on the right path when you've got nothing to prove. Because your identity residing within cannot be bought by the false ideologies, the false man-made religions, indoctrinations along with images that we buy into. Because it is all smoke and mirrors. It is bullshit. Those of you that say, portray said characters, did you honestly think that that's who you are? No. And if I was each and every one of you, I would advise you now to get right with God and kill these said characters. Because when you physically die, <clears throat> you will say, um, you will take even said characters to the grave with you. And these characters are nothing more than demons keeping you trapped and enslaved from finding out who you really are within your heart, your mind, and your souls. It's a wrap.